So this question looks like it's going to be a translate word problem question. So I'm going to read this a sentence at a time, making sure I understand what I read, and also making sure I write down any quantitative information. So the question starts off by saying the function f of w equals 6w squared. I'm going to rewrite that, f of w equals 6w squared, gives the area of a rectangle. Okay, so this is the area of a rectangle. I have no idea. It could be 2w and 3w, could be 6w and w. I do know that the area of a rectangle is base times height or length time width. I know there's a w involved there somewhere. Um, oh, so I have more information. If its width is w feet, okay, perfect. <laughs> I didn't even notice that was going to happen. So I already labeled its width as w. Uh, and its length is six times its width. Oh, so that makes this 6w. Which of the following is the best interpretation of f of 14? Well, f of 14, right? So we had f of w, which means f of 14 is simply replacing, right? It just means w equals 14, which means the width would equal 14. So what's the best interpretation of f of, w, of, f of 14 equals 1176? Well, without reading the answer choices, that should mean that when you have a rectangle that has a width that is 14 is it feet? Yes, that is 14 feet, right? W equaling 14. The area should be 1176. Um, that's what that should mean. So let's see the answer choices. If the width of the rectangle is 14 feet, then the area of the rectangle perfect. Like A has to be the right answer. Choice B, if the width of the rectangle is 14 feet, then the length of the rectangle, no, not the length, right? Again, our whole function here, our whole F of W represents the area, not the length. Choice C, if the width of the rectangle is 1176, no, that's not it. If the width of the rectangle is 1176, nope, that's not it either. The width is 14. So choice A is the best answer here.